Amy and Sean. 1027 VGS. I get, I'm a sports mom. I, this is, when I found out I was having, um, boys, I just, I mean, sports mom is like my vibe. That's my jam. I'm obsessed with it. Um, And it is stressful. It gets stressful for sure. Uh, But I have a PSA me, if you will, (laughs) that uh, people need to relax and get over yourself and get over your kids. Um, I have done a lot of things and I've been in arguments with parents in the stands and and I am actually proud to say it. <laughs> well, you've told me, yeah, you've told me with a, with a twinkle in your eye about the yeah. arguments and the altercations you'll get in in the stands with fellow parents. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mostly moms. But is it always? Uh, yeah, yeah. For the, but I mean, there are dads, but I, sure. I won't yell at them because then pa- poor Patrick has to pay for that one. You're writing checks; he has to cash. Yeah, yeah, yeah for sure. Uh, so, anyways, I I feel really, really bad. Um, we're we're constantly at the football field. We really are. But there was a um, a soccer game going on, and they were little kids um, just on a field next to us, and I witnessed a mom yelling at probably. A 12-year-old referee. Oh. Like, okay. come on, folks. What? So I'm staring like, what are you doing? I think that my son is a phenomenal football player, and I pray that he gets to go to the next level and play college football. I yeah. pray for that. And... You know, that's very difficult. It's also a nice Chances are, retirement fund. <laughs> yeah, well, that's the, the next, yeah, next that's level. Go. It's yeah, actually yeah. going to cost me a lot. <laughs> well, hopefully. Gets, so uh, we all would love for our, our kids to play professional sports sure. if they enjoy it, right? Odds are it's probably not going to happen. 0.1, maybe 0.01% of these kids will get a chance. And what do you know when, when your kid is six years old, seven years old, playing soccer, that they're going to be Pele? Like, come on. Why are you yelling at a little girl who is probably just making five bucks? And this or maybe is I, not this anything. This is I-9 sports you're talking about. Yes. This is not like, hey, we're doing this, this for real. This is not days. club. This is this chill. Is nothing. <laughs> there wasn't even like, I don't even think there was lines like of out of bounds. It was like a couple. I just feel so bad that parents, I feel like those parents uh, uh, were um, maybe not very great in sports and trying to live through their kids. A lot of that. And that makes me so sad because that poor little girl who was being the referee, probably for free, maybe her sister or brother was playing and like her mom made her do it. You know what I mean? Yeah. And she was getting yelled at by an adult because she called the wrong call or whatever. I would lose it. Uh, 702-597-1027. The bad behavior you've seen at youth sports. There's actually a story out of Rhode Island where this uh, teenage, like 17-year-old girl is a ref for a girls hockey tournament mm-hmm. and some parents from Pennsylvania start screaming at her she leaves in the middle of the game she's like i'm get like i'm i'm a volunteer right. i'm getting paid for this right and she walks off the ice and this keeps happening and happening now my dad was a little bit of an aggressive like an aggressive sports dad. Yeah. Like I would uh, go up to the plate and I wouldn't swing because I would get very nervous. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm going to try to say this without having to hit the dump button, but he would be in the crowd screaming, Sean, swing the boom back. (laughs) (laughs) So, and then, and there was one point. He's yelling at you and not some random kid, right? Well, then he'd yell at the coach because the coach wouldn't want me in for the required three innings (laughs) because I would just go up there and not swing. So my dad came down and like literally went on the field and got in the face of the coach and said, no, he's supposed to get three innings. You're not allowed to do this. And so I got in for the third inning and I hit the winning run. I will say, thank you, dad. (laughs) Um, But yeah, like sometimes I think as parents, you want to like, you think you're stepping up for your kid, yeah. but you're really just being a DB. Yeah. 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 It, it's so it's so frustrating. I've seen too many fights on the field. Not kids, parents. It's like, get a life, folks. Really. It's it's too much because that's where kids think like, oh, yeah, I'm going to fight somebody because cause you're seeing the parents do it. Yeah. Get over it. Can we all I, agree, though, so that professional referees should absolutely be blamed for everything. Uh, I don't know about that. That that stresses me out too. They're death threats and stuff. Like Angel Hernandez. Fans. Get I should over it. I should know that guy's name, but he is the worst umpire in the history of Major League <laughs> Baseball. This guy stinks so much. <laughs> he, he makes a salary though. I can make fun of him. But like a 17 year old girl. One. She just got her whistle. Just relax. Yeah. Calm down. Teresa, what have you seen on the field? 
Uh, actually, I was kind of part of it. Oh, no. <laughs> Tell All me right, more. Teresa, you know what? Let, uh, repent. My son was a freshman varsity quarterback, and uh, he was very good. So, of course, he's on the varsity. Yeah. Well, this one woman in the stands is yelling, take out that quarterback. Take out his knee. Wow. <laughs> yep. I stood up, and I looked at my husband. My husband shakes his head. I says, watch the kids lock their, their stroller in, told him here. <laughs> Walked over to her and said, you know that quarterback has a mother, and it's me. <laughs> <laughs> we, are, we are spirit animals, I'm telling you. It's called I Come Out as a Mother Bear. Amen. <laughs> Sister, I'm with you. Yeah, see, that's the thing. When the parents are yelling at the other kid, like, come on. That. I can't do the other kids. And you know, it's not like don't go, don't say go hurt someone. Right. Oh. Exactly. So gross. Exactly. It is and so gross. This is a sport where it could affect the rest of their life. Yep. And literally, you say take out their knees. My son is, you know, older now and he says, Mom, my knees are so messed up from people. Right. Oh, yeah. And I'm like, I'm so sorry, you know. I, hey, but, you know, when they say take out the knees, I, I become aggressive. <laughs> I'm with you. I am with you. Amen. We got to stick up for our kids.